Hello everyone and welcome to a 23rd C++ tutorial in my series of C++ tutorials. Um, I told you last time that this tutorial is also going to be on a, um, building uh, functions and I told you that I might show you one maybe two more building functions but um, I could only like think of one so uh, I'm only going to show you one and it's going to be real quick so uh, yeah you'll probably just get this in the first um, try and as you see I still have this um, building functions.cpp file open so uh, I thought I'd open it before this tutorial started to save some time so um, you should open it too and after it printed out uh, this random thing we would like to make it sleep again we would like to make it sleep um, like just two seconds again and you already know that so first of all after I calculated a um, random number from 0 to 10 it'll sleep uh, two seconds and then it'll print out the random number it uh, got and then it'll sleep two seconds again before it exit and zero this exit uh, function surprisingly enough uh, exits your program and uh, it doesn't really matter what you type in uh, as an argument in here I just always type zero it doesn't really matter what you type it's just like an exit status or something I really don't know what it does this argument and it doesn't matter it doesn't matter if you type 10 or zero in him it's just a number I don't know what they use it for but I just always type 10 because no uh, not 10 sorry I always just type 0 because you know kinda makes sense anyway to uh, see if it actually works just hit F9 and as you see it gets 5 and then it let's see going on right here one okay so apparently because Camtasia Studio makes my computer so goddamn laggy it um doesn't observe that it actually prints out a number two so we're just going to make it sleep um five seconds before it um at least I'm going to do that in this tutorial um before it um actually exits because I'll probably make it show the number too. And now it exits. Just like we wanted it to. So um, actually I'm just going to recap the whole source code real quick. Again, this um, gives the rand function that we're using down here. It gives it a unsigned um, integer variable which means that the variable it gets can change so it'll not always be 41 and then we set the maximum uh, range or the highest number the maximum number it can get is um, either 1 or 10 then it'll sleep 2 seconds and delay uh, this uh, see out action with 2 seconds and then after it uh, printed out this line right here after it did this line it'll sleep 5 seconds it'll delay this action five seconds and this action exits so it'll wait five t seconds and then it'll exit the program and again the argument you type in here doesn't really matter I just always type zero because um yeah I just think it makes sense so um actually that's your um, real quick tutorial on building functions part two kinda in though we just showed you one more function but unfortunately I didn't have time for that in the first tutorial so um I just made this tutorial real quick afterwards. So um, yep, I'll see you in my next tutorial and I don't know what it'll be about. And uh, by the way, if you like my Blender tutorials and would like to see more of them, then uh, just tell me.